Hi, Deck Reviews here, and today I'm going to review the Theory 11's Union Deck by Theory 11. Manufactured by the United States Playing Card Company. Here's the box. It's got really cool foiling and embossing in the front. Here's the top. sides and here's a glimpse at the back design very cool in case my camera couldn't catch it it says uh, Theory 11 on the front Union Liberty and Bravery like on the ribbons up here really neat box I like it a lot and then I really like the seal here it's kind of like one of the old playing card seals, kind of like a tax stamp. It's really neat. And here's the inside of the box. It's black. Oh yeah, and then some cool stuff here. Uh, wheat leaves or something like that. All right, so the cards include a Theory 11 ad card with a regular back, nice. Double backer. And two jokers. They're turkeys. Woo! Pretty cute. I like them. And here's the Ace of Spades. Very American. I like it. Red, white, and blue. Cool stuff. Alright, so here's a closer look at the real back design. Compared to the box for uh, reference. And here's a look at the faces. The faces have custom pips. Slight cool variant. A little chubby, I like it. Custom court cards. Alright, so that's the deck design. Now let's get into the handling of the cards. The cards are fantastic. These cards handle very well. Got a really good spring. Solid finish. These cards are very easy to fan. And with its back design and the thin borders, it really complements each other nicely. I like how it's not overly slippery. These cards break in pretty quickly. Making packets fun to do. Yeah, uh, that's, it's cool. This is a very good cardistry duck based off the handling. It's got a really sturdy stock. These cards are a little thinner than some of my other decks but it has like a really thick feel to it. Really good spring. You could do magic with it if you want to. It's a little pricey though, so I wouldn't use it for magic because it's a little harder to replace cards if you're writing on them. Great Pharaoh ability. And here's a giant fan. That looks beasty. Looks nice. So all around, very good deck. It's got a nice back design because it uses a lot of simple shapes and makes giant fans look nice. The th semi-thin borders makes thumb fans look quite nice when you do them. Like you don't even have to do like a full 
big thumb fan like I normally do. See, this is just a little dinky half a fan and looks pretty, pretty nice. The pit placement is fine. You can see the pips when you fan the cards. That's a big deal to me. Back then when Bicycle had the perfect pip cards, the pips were smaller and you couldn't see the numbers. You, don't, you won't have this problem with this deck. So all in all a good deck. I recommend it. If you've seen pictures online and you think this deck's for you, by all means get it. It gets my approval. Alright, well thanks for watching and you have a good day.